it's Melissa from Buckeye Girls Reason Things. I have accepted Michelle from Everyday Wife Life's August Health Challenge. Other words, we have to do something to get healthy in August. Well, the first thing I have decided to no longer drink the two liters of Mountain Dew I was drinking a day and go to water with crystal light in it. Definitely a big difference. And I'm going to eat more fruits and vegetables. I have decided that only four meals a week will be with meat in it. The rest will be vegetarian, which I was vegetarian before, so I'm kind of going back to what I was before. And I'm also going to try to get some more, get sleep a little bit more because if you know Melissa, Melissa doesn't sleep very well. It's nothing for me to only sleep three or four hours a night because I'm up and down all the time. So I'm going to try to get my sleep patterns a little bit better than they are. And the fourth thing, yeah, I'm doing four. Sorry, Michelle, you know Melissa can't count either. She can't figure out how big the, big the boxes are for your challenge, and now I can't count. But anyway, I'm either going to ride my bike for 30 minutes for three times a week, or I'm going to get more steps in. When I, right now, with my business, yes, Buckeye Girls Raisin Things is a business. We're an Etsy shop. And we do large craft shows all over the state of Ohio. So right now, I'm kind of going crazy making product for these festivals. Because I have some coming up. So I'm either going to get more steps in, which I will anyway, because I'm doing all this work for the festivals. Or I'll ride my bike 30 minutes three times a week, depending on... What I, the time I have with, with doing my working on my business. But that is my goal. And I've already lost 20 pounds. I started trying to lose weight last month because I just didn't feel good. Have you ever got to the point where you're like, I am so heavy, I just don't feel good. That was me, and I'm like, I got to do something about this. So if you're at that point, don't feel bad, don't feel depressed, do something about it. Try to change at least one thing. If it's nothing else like me, getting rid of the Mountain Dew. If I drink a Mountain Dew, it'll be maybe once or twice a week. It's not going to be what I was before. But if you don't feel good, do something about it. Get rid of the mount, the, the pop. Get rid of, eat healthier, something. That is my challenge, and that's what I'm doing this month. And we'll see how much weight I lose. I lost 20 pounds last month. Let's see how much weight I lose this month. Okay, today is Healthy Choice Challenge. I accepted Michelle's challenge to this month of August to try to get a little healthier. I started last month, actually. I've lost 20 pounds. Trying to do eat healthier and pick healthier choices. First of all, anybody that's been on my channel, anybody that's been on my Facebook, knows this was always in my hand when I crafted. I drank two over two liters of Mountain Dew a day. Which, you know, that is horrible. We know what Mountain Dew has in it. All the caffeine, all the sugar. Well, this month, starting this week, I'm not drinking this. I'm drinking this. You say, what is that? This is one pack of Crystal Light in two liters. So this is five calories compared to 170 in one of these. And I was drinking two liters. So right there is a big change for me. Do, you, do I have headaches? Yes, I've had headaches every morning this week. 
but it'll get better. That's my first healthy choice. Second healthy choices, choice is, here's my meal prep for lunch. I'm going to show you what I'm making for lunch. I'm going to do four lunches for me. Okay, we are going, we have four containers. I got these containers at Costco, but you can also get them on Amazon. And um, I'm going to start with corn, and I'm going to do a fourth of a can in each tray. And then I'm going to do black beans, fourth of a can in each tray. And I drain these. It's what, whatever, well, it's whatever you have on hand, whatever you want to use with this. And I do about a fourth of a cup. Or if you're doing chicken breast, I do about a half of a chicken breast. In each one. And my chicken, a lot of times, a lot of... A lot of times I like to use Montreal steak seasoning and just just uh, do a a nice rub on it and grill it. This is some pork tenderloin. And that's how I do that part. Blend from success. And this is what I use because it, yes, it's hot, a little high in carbs. It's got 9% carbs, 25 grams. But the reason I choose this over, say, rice is because it has 10%, 6 grams of protein. And I eat a lot of vegetarian meals this will be all the meat I eat for the week so to boost my protein I use this if you're keto you can more than happily change this from from this quinoa rice over to say cauliflower rice and uh, it would be just fine. And then the last thing I do, this is homemade salsa, but of course you can buy it at the store. I just sprinkle salsa across the top. And these will be my lunches. For the week and then the rest of the meals I eat vegetarian.